Hi guys, welcome to my channel and welcome to this video. So right now I'm outside again and still in Isan. I'm in front of my house and there's a road down there. You will definitely hear when people driving around. Yeah, this is how Isan is like, but that's not what I'm going to talk about today. Today we are going to learn some expressions that commonly used in Thai conversations. They are quite straightforward and handy, but some phrases might not make sense if you translate them word by word. But I'll give you some examples of what kind of situation that these phrases can be used in. They are neutral, so you can use them as much as you feel like. Call tua gon na ka or call tua gon na krab if you are a man. You can say this when you want to leave a conversation or if you are in a meeting and you have to pick up your phone. Say or before leaving the room. It can also be translated to excuse me in English, but it's used slightly differently. You also can use as a goodbye. This is neutral to quite formal. So you wouldn't use this with your friends or your partner. But if you smell a rat on the first date, you can use this to escape. Jat pai. Jat pai is used when you agree with someone to do something. When they ask for your opinion or suggestion, it means you completely agree with them. Like a big yes. For example, shall we get some tam for lunch today? Kiang ni kin some tam di mai? Absolutely. Jat pai. Jat pai. So it could mean yes, of course, sure, absolutely, or totally. Ta pai dai pai leo. Ta pai dai pai leo. I wish it could go. If your friends invite you to a party, and you already got plans or you're just busy or you just feel like you don't want to go you can say ไป dai ไป lao. ไป dai ไป lao. ถ้า is optional ถ้า ไป dai ไป lao. this word can be substituted by any verb for example กิน dai กิน ไป lao. กิน dai กิน lao. the same meaning you are on a diet and your friend is eating a cake in front of you and they ask you if you want some or if you are allergic to something that they offer the structure is verb plus die plus the same word that you mentioned earlier and แล้ว i wish i could do that ทำได้ทำไปแล้วทำได้ทำไปแล้วพูดได้พูดไปแล้ว so any verb ถามเฉยถาม just asking. This is just used like in English when you're trying to make conversation on a certain topic. But all you get is ทำไม which is why in response. So in this case, you can reply with ถาม ถาม just asking. No ครับ no ค่ะ no ฉัน just ถาม that's my crap. My tamada means not normal, not basic. That's awesome. You can use this when you are surprised. When you see something or hear something that is better than you expected or better than usual. You see your friend eats with a new shake and that shake is hot. My tamada. My tamada. My tamada, it's referred to how quick it's your friend to get that chick or how hot that chick is. Another example, if your friend say an English word that surprised you and you didn't know that he or she knew that word, you can say my tamada to them. My tamada. Oh, that's cool. Oh, now you are upgrading now. Something like that. My me arom. My me arom. I'm not in a mood when someone asks you to do something for them or to do something together but you are not in a mood you can say ไม่มีอารมณ์ไม่มีอารมณ์ sometimes we shorten it to ไม่มีรมไม่มีรม and รม it's อารมณ์ 
So รอเรือ that you have to roll your tongue. If you say ไม่มีลม it means I have no wind. So it doesn't make any sense. เสียเวลาเสียเวลา That's a waste of time. Such a waste of time. When someone asks you or suggests you to do something that you totally disagree, you can say เสียเวลาเสียเวลาไปง้อแฟนเก่าสิไปง้อแฟนเก่าสิ Go and make up with your ex, and you can reply with เสียเวลาเสียเวลา That's a waste of time. ให้ผมช่วยนะให้ผมช่วยนะอ๋อให้ฉันช่วยนะให้ฉันช่วยนะ So the pronouns can be replaced depending on you and the listener. If you want to master how to use Thai pronouns, click on the YouTube card. ให้ผมช่วยนะ means let me help you. If you see someone in need of some help, you won't ask them if they need help. Just say "Let me help you" instead, because even if they do, they might say "No, this is Thai." อะไรอีกล่ะอะไรอีกล่ะ When you are getting annoyed from getting asked so many questions, or when someone asks you to do something for them, you can respond with "อะไรอีกล่ะอะไรอีกล่ะ Meaning, what now? Or what do you want again? เอาเองสิเอาเองสิ If someone asks you to get something for them or to pass them something, you can say เอาเองสิเอาเองสิ When you feel like you don't want to help them or you just want to say to tease them, but in the end you will get that thing for them anyway. They will a little bit shock. That's it for today, guys. In this lesson, we learned most of the negative expressions regularly used in Thai. I hope you guys enjoy them and use them wisely because life isn't always about saying positive things. We are all human. Say whatever you feel like saying, as long as it's true and it doesn't harm anyone. Your Thai journey will be more enjoyable. I'll see you in the next one. You don't have to subscribe to my channel if you don't want to. You don't have to share if you don't want to. You don't have to like if you don't want to. That's that's it. That's what I'm gonna say. And yeah, so this is how it looks like in Isan. If you want to see how its life in Isan look like, what people do here, please let me know in the comment section below. I shoot some of the video, but I just have to try to figure it out and plan what I'm trying to. Say in that video. If you have any suggestion about that, please let me know in the comment section below. And I'll see you in the next one. Have a nice day. Bye.